Here are a few free CAD tips you just cannot ignore. Let's start with creating a sketch in the Part Design Workbench. Click on the XY plane to sketch on. Select the Circle tool and start drawing by clicking on the origin. Enter a diameter of 60 mm and press Enter. Click close to exit the sketch. Select the Pad feature to extrude the circle. Check Reverse to change the extrusion direction downwards. Click on this eye icon next to Origin to show the origin planes. As you can see, the top face is now aligned with the XY plane. A new sketch on the top surface can now be created independently of the model. Click on OK to apply the extrusion. Select the top face and click on the Chamfer Tool button. Did you know you can enter two distances? You can select it here. Enter 7 and 5 mm as shown. Click this button to swap the direction of the chamfer. Now change this distance to 10 mm, the same height as the model. Click on OK to apply the chamfer. A dialog box will appear with an input error. Click on OK to remove the message. Now do this instead. This video is sponsored by PCBWay. You can export 3D models directly to their website with this macro. Then select how it should be manufactured and configure your project details. Finally, preview your 3D model and submit your manufacturing request. Enter a distance of 9,99mm instead of 10. Click on OK to apply the chamfer. Now the chamfer is very close to the height of the model. You can also apply this trick to fillets. Click on this eye icon to show the origin planes again. Select the XY plane and create a new sketch. Click on this eye icon again to hide the origin planes. Select the circle tool and start drawing by clicking on the origin. The white sketch line is invisible on the white object. Click on the eye icon next to the latest feature to hide the model. Now you can see the sketch line much better. Of course, other color settings can help too. Enter a circle diameter of 30 mm and press Enter. Click on the eye icon next to the latest feature again to show the model. Click close to exit the sketch. Consider subscribing if you like my content, thanks. The sketch is on top of the model. Let's delete that model by removing these features and the first sketch. You see the second sketch with the smaller circle does not result in any errors. That's because it's independent because it was created on a plane and not a model face. You might want to check out my 3D printing channel for more tutorials and projects.